videos since the last upload. It's been a long time. Reason of absence. Busy life. I'll just leave it at that. It was never my intention to be gone for so long. I was never gonna quit the channel. That was not my intention. But, well, one thing led to, the, to another. And uh, anyway, it was a long time since we uploaded our last video, but I'm back now, um, I'm not gonna quit the channel, regardless of this, even if it happens again in the future, I'll try not to be gone again, especially for so long, but even if it happens again in the future, be sure that I will be back, because I enjoy the process, I like uploading videos and uh, talking and discussing about mine with you guys. This time, we're gonna go in depth, okay? I've been coming up with new ideas. Um, I'm gonna increase the budget. I'm thinking of opening, like, amazing quality, rare wine bottles. We have a lot to discuss about. Now, having said this, let's start reviewing wine. Once again, what do you think? So, for today's wine review, we're gonna review the variety Focus Gerbustraminer Crazy German name, I know Gerbustraminer or Gerbustraminer If you break it down the word, in the, if you divide it So Gerbust and Traminer, Gerbust in the German language means Spice or herb if you're from Germany and you're watching this I do not speak the language, you can confirm this Or you know, maybe correct me but I believe it means uh, spice or herb and um, this specific wine variety which is a white wine variety it can go from dry to sweet okay so many people are confused because they think that Gerbustraminen is a sweet wine variety it usually is but it can also be a white uh, it can also be uh, dry wine variety, okay, so it depends from the producer how we will create it, what style he wants to give this wine variety. Now, Gerbustraminer, it performs well in cool climates, okay, so this is usual, you'll find this mostly in regions such as northern France, Germany, you know, Alsace, border of northern France and Germany. Alsace is the number one, I believe, area where Gervostraminer is grown. And in this area, Gervost is the second largest um, producing wine variety. Now, the skin of the grape of the Gervost, I'm gonna call it Gervost, not Gervostraminer, because it's just a very long word, so Gervost. It's also called Mosque, maybe you've heard it like this. Uh, so the Gevort, the grape itself, has this light red color. So it's used for a white wine in opposition to the blue-black grape, which is used mostly for red wines. It can also produce white. Um, what else? It prefers a cool climate, as we mentioned and other regions that this wine variety or varietal is grown would be Italy, uh, USA, New Zealand, Switzerland but mostly the best results are from Alsace okay so northern France bordered with Germany it's a very aromatic wine remember Gerwood spice in German keep this in mind and Usually these wine varietals, you know, they go very high in alcoholic volume. So the ABV would be 13, 13.5, 14% alcoholic volume, which is high for a white wine. Um, what else can I give you guys here? Now there's a misconception about Gervostraminer, okay, so most people when listening about this wine, they think it's, uh, they automatically think it's a sweet wine. It can be a sweet wine, but it can also be a dry wine. 
design so it depends on the producer how he wants to create his final result so it can go from dry all the way up to sweet having said all this having informed you a little bit about the wine varietal of Kirkustraminen let's go grab a wine bottle of this varietal and uh, let's review it let go
So once again, let me jog your memory. Well, three factors, okay, let's break it down. Vision, nose, palate. This is how we examine our wine. So it has like, it's not see-through, it has like a thick goldish color. Very beautiful color, I don't know if you can see this. You know, the more you age white wine, the more yellow it gets. I don't know if you can see it through the camera, but this is very, like a very bright gold color. Seems like a medium skin grape. Let's see on the nose, let's give it a swirl. Okay, so straight away, very fruity. Summer fruit like apricot, green apples, peaches. Trying to detect the spice. As in the theory, I can't really find it here. Maybe, maybe a little bit of cinnamon, I'm not sure. Uh, biscuit. Honey, rose, very interesting, let's see on the palate, cheers.
do not begin here Okay, this is a little bit more advanced uh, Check Leon Bayer or any Get words you would find in Alsace And uh, we're back people, I'm so glad to be back I can't wait for your comments and your suggestions And I guess I'll see you soon in the next video I'll try to upload as much as possible we're gonna begin with once a week and we'll see how it goes depending on how the channel grows Stay tuned because we got like amazing wine bottles That we're gonna review soon So once again this was wine is a mod drink responsibly and I'll see you guys soon